Um, I just wanted to make a video um, to kind of give a shout out to this uh, this this guy I respect. He's he's a he's an INFJ. <clears throat> he does the INFJ Circle channel. He knows what he's talking about. <laughs> Anytime I'm confused about myself, I, I'm down on myself. I don't get why why I'm so different from everybody. <laughs> then he, 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 you know, I watch his channel. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know, he gets it. He does. He understands the INFJs. He does very well. <laughs> More than I do. More than I do. That's saying something. <laughs> I just wanted to give a shout out to him, you know, to let him know he's awesome. <laughs> That's why I want to start the day, because his videos help me. They do, yeah, because it is hard. It is hard to be an INFJ in this world. It is. I don't care how hard you try to make to. I don't care how hard you try to to not have a hard life. As a, you're gonna have a hard go as an INFJ. He said something that was uh, uh, pretty key. He said, we're like the X-Men. Yep, just like I do. <laughs> we're like the X-Men in Europe. We are. The INFJs are like the X-Men we are with our gifts and stuff. <laughs> no accident, I heard that. I'm like, another INFJ sees it like I do. X-Men of the on the earth we are. <laughs> we are. From everything to being outcasted, to being gift gifted, to being you know what I mean? It's so relatable, it's not even funny. So anyways. He doesn't watch my channel, but I just want to say give a shout out to him, you know. Because he helps me. I, I like the guy I do. That's what I want to say. I like him. Say, is that you know? Yeah. Anytime I'm feeling down in the dumps, I watch his channel. I feel, I feel, I feel fine. You know, there's nothing wrong with me. You know, I'm just made different. You know. God bless him. God bless him for 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 not seeing me. And all of us INFJs as freaks of society. Thank, thank you, my friend. <laughs> thank you for seeing us as beautiful souls. You know, <laughs> I appreciate that. You know what I mean? I appreciate that. <laughs> like you're not the same. <laughs> you know? Yeah, man. That's all I want to say. That's really it. So. God makes no mistakes, even with us. <laughs> Even with us INFJs, I think we're a mistake like I did. God makes no mistakes. Even with the INFJs <laughs> that are different from all society. <laughs> Said something I didn't know. I didn't know Marcus Aurelius was a, an INFJ. I didn't know that, but it makes sense. It does. It does. When you read what he says, I'm like, yeah, that's something I would say. <laughs> He's like, this world sucks. <laughs> These pe the people on the earth suck. <laughs> are cool. They're the cool ones. <laughs> yes, they are. They have the gifts. <laughs> Different gifts. Given by God. You know. In my opinion. So.
I appreciate his content, you know. Um, very helpful. Very helpful. And he's right about one thing. The INFJs are more powerful together, like the X-Men team. They are. Yeah. Instead of instead of just flying solo completely. The INF the INFJs to get together are forced to be reckoned with you know, when they're united. You know, I mean, like for Captain Planet, you know, united, you know, heart, earth, you know, united. You know, we're more powerful. We are stronger for sure. I think God set it up that way. With us combined, we're stronger. I'm just like, I like that guy. <laughs> I'm going to make a video for him. I like that guy. That's that's what I'm saying. I like that guy. Yeah, I do. <laughs> he does some of the stuff I do, you know what I mean? <laughs> that the world would be, the, the whole world would be like, that's just, that's nothing. You know? <laughs> you know, just, you know, making videos and, you know, <laughs> all that stuff, you know. Chilling, chilling by yourself, reading a book sometimes, you know, reading the Bible book, you know. doesn't get us. They don't get us. They don't understand us at all. And that's frustrating. It's frustrating that no one gets us. They don't get us. You know? Even even we don't get us. You know what I mean? That's why I turn to God. You know, I'm like, he gets me. He gets me. He can help me. You know, God can help me. He made me. You know what I mean? You know, I did the logic. You know, I did the logic. You know, so far it's been true. He does know how to help me. You know? Yeah. Like you made me. You know what you know what would bring me the most joy, God. You made me. Make it happen. Make it work. I I don't know what to, to do to make me joyful. Have a joyful life. I don't know what to do. But God. <laughs> like I know exactly what will make you happy. Glory's coming, my friend. It's coming. <laughs> yep. Glory's coming. <laughs> yep. Glory to the Father, though, not glory to me. Nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> no, that's a weakness to have glory for myself. Glory to the Father. Yep. <laughs> yep. I'm learning. It's only because of God's mercy that I'm alive. It is. It's just His mercy. It's not because of me. No. <laughs> Any glory that happens because of me is because of God. Yeah. So. <laughs> For sure. There was, a, there was an interesting scripture that I never really saw before. But I heard it before <laughs> from Soldier of the Lord, and Cindy showed it to me as well. It's a scripture of like, God will show mercy to whom He will He chooses to show mercy to. No one can influence God about His the mercy He will show to somebody. That's what He did with me. You know what I mean?
he's like, why do you show mercy on that guy? You know what I mean? <laughs> that guy doesn't even like God. 